Okay. <laughs> I forgot I was wearing a bucket hat. So welcome to Splatoon 3. Uh, I think we're alive now. So this is the this is the Splatfest. And I'm looking at the I'm looking at Nintendo's webpage and oh I think these flying things have the girls on top of them. So I don't think you can see the brown one because she's on top of nope yeah. yeah that's that's one of them. And I think the other one is Yeah, that's the other one. Yep, that's both girls. Okay, uh, so we're here. We're here to play. So I think for the first six hours, I think you play one team at a time in Turf War, and then for the other six hours, you're playing uh, three teams at once, I think. Uh, all this stuff about Big Man. Okay. Um, I want, well, actually, I want to leave after this. Uh, welcome to the lobby. It's your portal to online battles and where you stash all your gear. Oh, okay. As you splat forth in online battles, you'll level up and earn cash to boot. Why level up and get cash? So you can access and afford the freshest gear in Splatsville. And some battle modes are restricted to players at a higher level too. So get that level up. Well, this is exciting. There's a Splatfest going on right now. You can head over, you can head right over to the Battle Pot and select Splatfest Battle Open if you want to join. That'll launch you into a turf war where your team has three minutes to ink the most turf. And let's chat more Splat, let's get started. Just a heads up, you won't get any of the stuff that matters. Also save data won't carry over. Yeah, I figured it's just a, it's just a beta. Uh-huh. Community guidelines apply. Don't be a jerk. Ugh. Okay, so where is my gear stash? And can I? Oh, this is the. Okay, cool. See, I, I think these are the regular splat dualies. I don't remember. I think the dapple dualies are a little faster. So I should be able to swap a weapon, right? Turf map, menu, turf map. Okay. So I can toggle the map. Okay, toggle between the map and the menu. What's the match menu? Which one's the best? Oh, so you can, you don't have to go over to the pot. You can just start from wherever you are. My character is cute. <laughs> I did a good job. What is clean up? Turn the copy machine. Ah, it's, oh, clean up the paint. Okay. Uh, can I switch a weapon? Yes, I can. They let you switch weapons. Okay, so this lets you, you don't, you don't, you no longer have to do the training thing from the, uh, from the weapon shop. Uh, so what is the, what's the new stuff, right? That's a slosher. The Splatana Wiper. Let's, let me check out the, the crossbow. I like range first. Um, and then I can, they say you can clean up, right? Okay, so I wiped the map. Uh, so this is, gosh, red is my favorite color. Okay, so how does this work? Oh, it's a. So it, it kind of reminds me of a rifle. Or uh, what is it? It's kind of like part rifle, part like the the charging reminds me of the Gatling gun. Oh, and they explode. Oh, really? So can you can you roll? You can't roll. Okay, so if you're tapping it, if you're tapping it, you just fire paint. If you charge it, you get to fire off paint missiles. And if you char double charge it, you shoot farther missiles. Okay, tap it for paint. Uh, okay. So I, and it's it's a mid it's mid range. You get the most amount of uh you get the most amount of area for mid range. Man, this arrows land fast. Okay, and as soon as you charge another round, the other ones the other ones detonate quick. 
That's very far. <laughs> okay. Uh, got it. So, I think. Oh, shoot. Let me try the the special, right? Oh, that's just the killer whale. Yeah, that's just that's just the killer whale. Okay. Um. Let me do the katana, right? I think every other weapon in here is the same. Like the only ones they, the only new ones they introduced were the crossbow and the katana. So I'll probably run, give both a shot. Oh, that's right, sub weapons, right? Well, I think the, well, let me see. Let me clean this. Match menu, clean up. And this is a sword. Oh, that no, that's that's the special. Give me a second. How long can I go before I gotta reload? Okay. So it's a little different from your um from your brushes. Your brushes are close range. Okay, and it fires in a straight line. Okay. And Okay, got it. So the sword slashes the sword slash doesn't take very long to level up. Uh how, how does that do on enemies? Oh, you still get maximum damage even if you're far away from your opponent. I thought it was a kind of deal where if it's up close, it does the most. Okay, so it does do the maximum damage if you're if you're way up close. Then yeah. So, I, okay, so I can't charge it when I'm in squid form either. Okay. So it takes four swings? It takes four regular swings. Okay, so if you're not in their face, you're gonna get half the damage. If you are in their face, then you'll get the full damage. It takes four regular swings. It takes four regular swings to do it, so you could charge it at range and then get off two small swings. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. Let me, what's this thing called? It's just the inflatable dolphin or the inflatable shark, right? Listen, you for you guys, I may like fly past this in like two two or three minutes. For me, I've been playing for like eleven minutes, just in the training mode. Press R. Okay, so if it goes in a straight line, you can't you can't steer it. But you can detonate it along its path. You don't have to wait until it stops. Okay. And the specials the special's good for just getting in there fast and blowing something up. Like the weapons I enjoy using, uh, here's let me try the snipers, right? Because I don't like the snipers, and I, I like snipers in FPS games and FPS multiplayer. I don't like the Splatoon rifles. They're, they've just always been too slow for me to use. Nah, it still functions the same. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, what else we got? What is this? The suck in the opponent's ink. Really? Oh, cool. <laughs> I like that. You can suck in the opponent's ink and then fire it back at them as your own. Okay. I gotta check that out. Okay, so. This is your regular ink mine. And this is the new one. Make waves. Oh. 
Oh, okay, that acts as an enemy. Okay. Okay, it's not hard to jump over it. Okay, got it. So if, the, if they're hiding in ink and they don't want to jump out, then yeah, they'll get detected. Okay. Um, that's cool. Okay. R and Z are to fire at will. <laughs> okay. It's a man. It, it only lasts for a short while, but was that really it? Man. Okay, and then the tank. Okay, you can fire the cannons with your sub button. Or you can fire the guns with your main weapon button. Man, it only lasts for a short time, you know? Okay. Crab tank. You know, I think of these. Well, hang on. There's one more. What is this? The big bubbler. Does it follow me? It doesn't follow me. It doesn't follow me, but you can use it to camp, I guess. Okay, you get an audio cue and, and it shrinks. Okay, but you have to you have to keep stationary. Okay. Is that the only weapon that runs that? I like the defense. I like the defensive specials. Um, you gotta deploy this someplace where you, your opponent can't get to it, or where you can easily see them. Um, I feel like that'd be well. It might be. It might be good for snipers. Is there a sniper that has that? No, that's just the that's just the big ink mine. What is this? Okay, so what are we doing here? What is this? Oh, it's just it's just ads. Okay. Um stretch your arm. Really? Okay. Oh, that's so short. But I can fire my main weapon. Okay, so you you can use it for repositioning then. And I'm assuming that it's got some kind of invulnerability thing to it or some kind of high defense kind of thing to it. All right. I don't know if that synergizes well with the brush. Well, here's the thing. I think it's not like you can stick to walls and use your weapon while you're stuck to walls, can you? Because I'm using the brush and it's like anytime I want to use the weapon, I'm going to drop off of the wall and land and then use my weapon. What is uh? What is that on the splatter shop? The angle shooter. A uh, sub weapon that fires straight forward and leaves a line in its path. Opponents that are hit directly will take damage, and those that touch the remaining line will be marked. When a shot hits a solid surface, it will bounce off it and continue in a. Come on, come on what? Huh? Dude. Okay, you can fire it three times. So anybody that anybody that crosses into the path of it. It does 30 <laughs> 30 damage. Really? And it flies out fast. So if they get hit with it, they also get marked. And anybody that runs in <laughs> Anybody that runs into it will also get marked. Okay, that's a good one. And you can throw out multiples if you miss. I think you can throw out three if you have a full tank. Okay, no, you can only throw out two. Okay, I like that one. So, let's... Okay, so once something crosses in front of it, the beam goes away. But if it, if nobody crosses in front of it, oh no, actually, does it sit for a shorter amount of time if the beam is longer? No, it just lasts for the same length of time. I feel like it goes away quicker once people are tagged. 
that might just be me though we have the the arrow spray with this i guess this pop can what does the fizzy bomb do bomb loaded with a special ink hold r to build power unleash up to three explosions shake the controller move the stick or mash buttons to build power faster uh Okay, so you can shake the controller, you can press buttons, or you can move sticks. Oh! Okay, it's like a bomb that explodes into mini bombs. So what happens if you do it raw? Really? If you just... Okay, and it gives you a cue. It, it ticks. It ticks if you if you shake it. Yeah, you... Yeah, you can hear the tick. Yeah, and... Okay. Got it. So I, I still like I think the ink vacuum is the is the is the coolest one for me for for the specials, the the crab tank I like the crab tank but the crab tank it doesn't it doesn't last very long, um, so I'll probably run this tent umbrella at some point to give that a shot. Uh, first though we use the crossbow. The crossbow comes with toxic mist and the killer whale, so I'm curious to see how that how that runs. Oh, you can, oh, okay, you can aim where you're gonna go. All right, let's check this out. Right now, we'll just focus on figuring out our weapon. So this feels like more of a supporting kind of deal. So I can... Okay. Okay, so that's its range. I'm listening to the music. Okay, it's harder to... <laughs> okay. Ranged weapon. Oh, that's right, we got tags now. And I can choose where to fire. Already, I'm like, I don't want to get up close. <laughs> right it's a fast shooting weapon but I feel like I'm a little oh well that's right this is turf war right this way booyah so what is my thing I have the ink the ink mist that's the thing is that I'm not I'm not causing any damage by hitting somebody with the direct hit of this weapon interesting let's try to get in somebody's face hmm I really want to like not talk and just listen to the music Yeah, it, okay, so it does damage when it hits, but I can't, I, yeah, I can't roll my way out. I have to hang back. Mr. Fett, okay. I'm helpless. <laughs> okay, so 
there's a reason why they let you fire a bunch of shots. So maybe I should throw down mist first to make my life a little easier. I can fire it fast, so there is that. Okay. Oh, really? Well, it feels different. Number two, Splatter Sister. Hotlantis. So a visit Hotlantis at level four. Cloud Splatfest points. Okay. So that's the first. That's the first game. I'll play one more game with the crossbow. Woo, oh, so that's what battles are like. Hey, did you happen to notice how some of your opponents had cool-looking name displays? Those are called splash tags, and they're fully customizable. To show off your personality. Wait, you haven't even set up a nickname for your splash tag yet. You gotta show up in style to your next battle. Hit the lobby terminal and set a nickname, okay? What do I wanna call myself? Well, Sonic and Nux is, is totally good. Well, let's try again, because maybe I should let people know that I'm on YouTube, right? Oh, no, it's only 10 characters. So, yeah, Sonic and X is good. <laughs> when I originally created this nickname, it was because I had only a certain amount of characters to run with. Choosing a nickname that violates the guidelines. Yes, 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 I know. Nickname registered. If you received an ID with an... Oh, if you change your nickname, the ID will also change. It's 1046 is my ID number. I know a lot of people get real excited about having zeros in their, in their ID numbers. Uh, now that you got a fresh splash tag, it's time to get out there and make it famous. Okay. Uh, let's 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 put some work in with the crossbow. I'll keep going. So when I was fighting the, when I was firing on these things. Okay, no, it it does do damage. I just wasn't firing properly. It's got two markers on it, but like realistically, you're only gonna hit with one mark with one with one marker. Okay, so it does actually do damage if you fire if you fire the charge shot. I thought that the, it wasn't doing damage until ap like it wasn't doing big damage until after the arrows land. All right, so practice makes perfect, and we can I'll fire here. So I can set up here. It's really, yeah, like lay down a spot, throw down some mist to block the way. <laughs> Great. So we can move up a little. Go down an ink mist. I can harass my opponent. Yeah, but I don't I don't want to be in the fight. <laughs> it is, it's kinda it's kinda like a sniper. Wow, this is this is harassment. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, let's let's check out up top. Throw down a mist. We'll figure out where the enemy is. Connection unstable. What happened? Did pe people disconnect it? You're kidding. Whoa. 
<laughs> I think people, I think people quit. Oh well, I'll take the whole field if that's the case. <laughs> yeah, my everybody just connected. It said unstable connection, but I'm still connected. So, me and this other person. So, unless they're just a CPU. But I don't. Well, that's the thing. I got to get close to them to see if they are. Who knows? Maybe I did get disconnected. Ugh. No, that's an actual person. <laughs> I'm like, that is an, that is an actual person that I, that I got killed by, so. Okay, cool. Number one overall splatter turf anchor and number one popular target. I like it. Okay. It looks smoother, right? I, I feel like you spend less time looking at the menus and more time. It, it's when it's when they integrate the menu. They integrate the result screen in the training area. Let me change gear because I went two games with the crossbow. I like the crossbow, right? Oh, 23, 23 seconds. Uh, go to the where's the katana? Here we go. Here we go. Katana, yeah. Let's give that a shot. Uh, so what is this? Oh, these are my teammates. Oh no, this is just my Splatfest rank is up. These are the guys on my friends list, I think. Nine minutes ago. Yeah, these guys are my friends list. <laughs> I know these guys. These are, these are the Pokemon players, the Pokemon tournament players. 